Hi everybody, it's updating time. All of the um, Dynamics related plugins can be updated because they all have new features. Let's start with the um, limiter number two. Um, this plugin here um, had the problem um, that it didn't reset the um, values it shows here when you switch from input to output metering, that's fixed. And there's a new feature um, that has been um, requested several times. And this is um, that the threshold and the ceiling would be linked. And you can do that by holding Alt and dragging the threshold. And now wait, isn't that a hidden feature? Yes, we've talked about hidden features uh, recent days. So all the plugins now, or the plugins you can update, it will follow in all the other plugins as well, have this little menu button here. And you can click that, and there you can link the threshold and the output ceiling. So it's not really hidden, it's just a um, shortcut with the pressing Alt thing, and you can uh, unlink these again. And you can say show info. And it says, there's a tip, quick link, threshold and output with Alt. And it says this plugin can be automated. And this is true for all the plugins you see here. Um, you turn a knob, click on parameters, and it says last touched release or last touched threshold and so on. And that um, automation support now is available for all the um, Dynamics plugins. So the updates are um, primarily about um, these um, menu boxes where you can um, see what's going on with um, yeah, formerly hidden features. Um, let me show it on the um, this treasure plugin where you can now select feedback detection or feed forward detection, what was a hidden feature, or um, attack and release times are interactive with the input. Um, you can switch that off. Um, there was a hidden feature before. Um, you can switch to old boggy mode. That was a hidden feature before. Um, Sidechain is not really hidden. It's uh, You can click the LED, um, but um, for people who don't know that, sidechain can be assessed here. Um, listen to sidechain can be assessed here. That was a hidden feature. And um, if you click the info box, it tells you that the screw next to ratio two by one is the headroom amount. And if I hover here, the screw now says headroom. And um, we have uh, tips as well. Uh, that the ratio LEDs are clickable, detector and audio LEDs are clickable, so you can just click the ratios or um, what you want as an option here. Um, that has been available all the time, um, but now it's not hidden because you, um, you're you told so that this exists. Same here for the um, compressor too. If you hover the screws, it says knee, it says dry mix, it says meter speed. So now um, you you know what the screws are doing. And um, I will not make um, hidden features uh, again. At least they will be available here in the um, uh, menu so that you can um, access uh, formerly hidden features from the menu. The only thing um, that is, well, semi-hidden are these um, silver screws. But as you can see, this screw, or this screw, or this screw, this screw down here, um, it's always these little silver screws that um, that are actually knobs. And they all tell you um, that they're knobs when you hover them. So that's my um, solution for the um, hidden features and how to handle that. Um, some people, or most most people, uh, said um, it would be okay um, by hitting F1 and um, getting uh, hints to the um, hidden features. Um, 
but others uh, convinced me by saying, well, um, on Apple computers, uh, the function keys are often uh, for, for something else and you have to, to hit a function function key um, to access this. Others said, um, well, at least you had to place a uh, text somewhere that says uh, press F1 for help. And I thought that would be very ugly on the um, plugin surface. So um, pressing F1 would be kind of hidden feature itself. So I decided not to make that. And I think the um, menu um, buttons we see here are um, commonly known as a symbol um, for menus. Um, we have on, on smartphones and, and, and other software. So I hope uh, that everybody gets that this is a clickable item. Others said that no feature should be hidden in any way. Um, but keep in mind these um, features we have in the, um, in the menus here um, are not features that are um, essential for um, using the plugin. It's more for advanced use or um, yes, yeah, something um, I thought which could be an option um, that some of you could be missing if it isn't there. And also um, the things on the little screws are no essential features. So headroom adjustment or um, soft knee um, didn't exist in the, um, in the early versions. Um, and um, you could do a um, parallel compression uh, other than turning this screw. This is just uh, an offer from me. So um, actually uh, the knobs you, you need for using the plugins um, are all on the um, plugin user interface and um, other things are just um, advanced use. I hope you all like my solution to the um, problem of hidden features and these little screws. And now you can all update the plugins and then have fun with the plugins. Yeah, bye bye.